Hello, this is Chris. I am at the uh, Seattle RV Show out here in Seattle, Washington. Got in here last night, and I am sitting here with a wonderful, wonderful woman who is patiently waiting uh, for her new little guy, Max. So if you could introduce yourself, that'd be great. Hi, my name is Dana Pierce, and I'm from Puyallup, Washington. And uh, I bought my little guy, Max, a few months ago. It's at the dealership now, and I'm waiting to take possession, and I'm very excited about it. I know, and I know you're excited, and I know we've talked a million mm -hmm. times, and it's great to come out here and meet you, and you know, we've met all the others already mm -hmm. out here today, Cheryl Johnson and some of the ones. Um, what, what, uh, what were you looking for in a trailer? What were you originally looking for? What, what made you go into the process? Um, I had gone, um, did a 3,000 mile trip last summer with my uh, daughter, son-in-law, and my grandchildren. And when we were out, because we stayed in hotels, I was seeing different little uh, RVs, and yeah. I thought, wow, wouldn't that be fun? And I, in getting close to retirement, and so I thought, I would like to do that when I retire. I'd like to have a little trailer and just travel all over the place. And uh, so just started doing a little bit of research, and one day I saw the little guy sign on an on a trailer that was being driven down the freeway and it wasn't the max but um, it got me to where I needed to go to go look and then so finding the little guy max and then when I was able to go and see that Janine Pettit had and and it kind of gave it that women's appeal sure and everything about it is it's what I need because I I'm not married and so something that I could handle so on my own my and that would be like a home away from home what's going to be the where's going to be the first place you go and i'm sure you've thought about this a lot and i have um i've already booked um crater lake in oregon okay. for uh labor day weekend right and my grandchildren are going with me i've never been down there in all the years that i've lived up here fun for you uh yeah so i'm really looking forward to it and i know we talked about one of the um changes one of the modifications that mm -hmm. you're going to make to personalize this this trailer we just got done talking about mm -hmm. it. what was that um i bought uh for the the uh, shower door that uh, there's been a lot talked about sure. online about it and um, so I just a few people had posted on your web you know on the Facebook page and so I got on Amazon and I found this beautiful stained glass looking film that has a pe uh, peacock on it and it looked like stained glass window and I actually got it yesterday so I can't wait to put it on the door and that gives it for me that gives me an opportunity to personalize Right. trailer and I know the one that you're gonna be picking up and and I definitely have to give a shout out to everybody here at Apache Camping Center mm -hmm. up here um, that's where you're gonna be picking yours up mm -hmm. at. and you were getting one with the walnut interior what yes. made you choose the walnut well I was always a lighter wood person and I think that because and I never saw the walnut before it actually mine actually came in um, the and I was, like I said, a lighter wood person, but it seemed warmer. And I was afraid, you know, some people say, well, isn't it too dark? And I had always kind of been that way. But I think that with the, all the windows in here and there's so much lighting that it doesn't make it dark, it makes it warmer nice. for me. And that's nice. what I liked. Well, we're excited about it. And, you know, one of the little funny tidbits in, for all of our people out there in social media and Facebook uh, community, uh, obviously a shout out to your friend and Tobias King. Mm -hmm. um, oh, who, yeah. down in uh, down in Texas. I'm right. sure she'll like hearing this. Yes, I'm sure that, she will. Yeah. That uh, she was one of your neighbors growing up. Right. She another, lived across the street from me when we were children. <laughs> another happy little guy, Max. Uh -huh. Right. So that's nice that, that um, you just never know who you're going to run into and you yeah, know, within you this little world that, that's been created. Mm -hmm. So And I think it's going to be a very good community. Um, everyone that seems to buy it seems to be so excited about it. And so um, I... I have looked at a lot of other trailers and this one just seems so much homier, so so warm. All the little details that have been thought about, the lighting, the cabinets, the, the drawer space, the storage space all through it is just amazing. Well, that's awesome. And thanks for taking the time to uh, hang with me and come out and meet. And, you know, it's funny, I, I was the, as soon as I walked in the show, there was multiple people coming up to say hi and stuff. I'm and sure that's always such a good feeling. Mm -hmm. that, I'm sure it and, is. I mean, because I love getting out to the shows and meeting everybody. I'd much rather be out here than being in the office oh, yeah. dealing with all that. Well, it's great but, being able to meet you, too. <laughs> I, well, yeah, I know. I'm a pretty big deal. So, <laughs> anyway. Thanks, Dawn, and uh, you oh, know Dana. you can reach out. Dana, why did I that's say Dawn? Okay. Why am I thinking Dawn? There's I'm, another Dawn. I have a sister named Dawn. Well, see, that's who I was thinking <laughs> that's of. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dana, thanks for everything, and uh, uh, have a blast with your new Oh, mix. I will. Thanks. I will.